In this video, we are going to look into the slope of a line when coordinates of any two points on the line are given. In the previous videos, uh, when we looked into slope, we just looked into slope, you know, however to find the slope only when, when we just had the angle that, you know, the angle in whichever the line was inclined to the x-axis. But in this case, we do not have the angle to find out the slope. If we have the angle, it is simple as m equals tan theta. But we, do, but we do not have the angle in which the line is inclined with the positive x-axis. But in this video, we are going to find slope in a different way when we do not have the angle. But when we have the coordinates of any two points on the line. So let's look into how do we find the slope of a line when the angle is not given, but when we have the coordinates of any two points on that line. All right, here is the diagram that we needed. The blue line is that line whose slope we are trying to find. The theta, we do not know the value of theta, but we do know two points. We have the coordinates of two points, P and Q. Just any two random points on this line. It can be here, 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 anywhere. It is right here in these green dots here, P and Q. So when you have these two points, and when you do not have the angle in which the line L is inclined to the positive x-axis, how do you find the slope? This is how you find the slope. All you have to do is, you know that the slope is represented by M. It is denoted by M. M equals Y2 minus Y1. The, the difference of the or, ordinates, the y-axis, the points on the y-axis is called as the ordinates. So Y2 minus Y1 divided by x2 minus x1 which is called as the abscissa so it is nothing but the ratio of the differences between the ordinates and the abscissa that is how you find the slope of a line when coordinates of any two points on the line are given so this is another very simple way of finding the slope when you do not have the theta so you have to like really really remember that you know how to find the slope whenever the angle in which the line is inclined is given and you also have to know when you have to find the slope when the angle is not given but the two points two random points the coordinates of those two points on the line are given. So this is how you find the slope when you have coordinates of any two points on the line. All right. So that ends this video. I'll see you in the forthcoming videos with problems based on this concept that we did in this video.